Today is the Jazz and Friends National Day of Reading, so I'm about to read I Am Jazz for all of you. I am jazz. I am jazz. For as long as I can remember, my favorite color has been pink. My second favorite color is silver. My third favorite color is green. Here are some of my other favorite things. Dancing, singing, backflips, drawing, soccer, swimming, makeup, and pretending I'm a pop star. Most of all, I love mermaids. Sometimes I even wear a mermaid tail on the pool. My best friends are Samantha and Casey. We always have fun together. We like high heels and princess gowns, or cartwheels and trampolines. But I'm not exactly like Samantha and Casey. I have a girl brain, but a boy body. This is called transgender. I was born this way. When I was very little and my mom would say, you're such a good boy. I would say, no mama, good girl. At first my family was confused. They always thought of me as a boy. As I got a little older, I hardly ever played with trucks or tools or superheroes, only princesses and mermaid costumes. My brothers told me this was girl stuff. I kept on playing. My sister says I was always talking to her about my girl thoughts and my girl dreams and how one day I would be a beautiful lady. She would giggle and say, you're a funny kid. Sometimes my parents let me wear my sister's dresses around the house. But whenever we went out, I had to put on my boy clothes again. That made me mad. Still, I never gave up trying to convince them. Pretending I was a boy felt like telling a lie. Then one amazing day, everything changed. Mom and dad took me to meet a new doctor who asked me lots and lots of questions. Afterward, the doctor spoke to my parents and I heard the words transgender for the very first time. That night at bedtime, my parents both hugged me and said, we understand now, be who you are. We love you no matter what. This made me smile and smile and smile. Mom and dad told me I could start wearing girl clothes to school and growing my hair long. They even let me change my name to Jazz. Being Jazz felt so much more like being me. Mom said that being Jazz would make me different from the other kids at school, but that being different is okay. What's important, she says, is that I'm happy with who I am. Being Jazz caused some of the other people to be confused too, like the teachers at school. At the beginning of the year, they wanted to use the boys' bathroom and play on the boys' team in gym class, but that didn't feel normal to me at all. I was so happy when the teachers changed their minds. I can't imagine not playing on the same team as Casey and Samantha. Even today, there are kids who tease me or call me by a boy name or ignore me altogether. This makes me feel crummy. Then, I remember that kids who get to know me usually want to be my friend. They say I'm one of the nicest girls at school. I don't mind being different. Different is special. I think what matters most is what a person is like inside. And inside, I am happy, I am having fun, I am proud. I am jazzed.